na nimesema ya kwamba mwaka ujao tutaongeza mbolea ile tutapatia wakulima from 4 million to between 7 and 8 million kwa sababu tunataka kumaliza kabisa mambo ya njaa katika taifa letu la Kenya once and for all nyinyi mnanielewa so that is what we are going to do that is how we are going to change Kenya na hivyo ndivyo tutasukumana mpaka Kenya iende laini so mimi i am not surprised by all this noise because people know that Kenya is going to change and those who don't want us to change want to derail and sabotage this change that is necessary and that is imminent but i want to promise the people of Kenya that we are marching forward with the education of our children we are marching forward with creating jobs for our young people and our program is to create a million jobs this year for our young people we are going to march forward to produce food in Kenya we are going to march forward to produce as many products from fish to furniture to cement to steel in Kenya so that we can produce our own wealth create our own jobs and eliminate the shame of hunger and make sure that our young people have work to do and also ensure that we eliminate poverty in our country watu wa homa bay mtashirikiana na sisi kwa hiyo safari homa bay mtashirikiana na sisi mimi nataka nisikie sauti ya watu wa homa bay homa bay mtashirikiana na sisi hebu ni wale wale wanasema tutatembea hiyo barabara pamoja tutatembea hiyo barabara pamoja mimi mwisho mimi nataka niwaeleze hii Sema najua marafiki zetu wamesema ya kwamba wanataka kupanga maneno ya maandamano. Mimi nataka niwaambie hivi. It is okay because we have a constitution that gives everybody rights. We are going to have a conversation as a nation about demonstration. We must have a candid conversation about what amounts to demonstration because we cannot continue to use the excuse of demonstrations to destroy property public or private to destroy businesses of people of Kenya to cause mayhem and anarchy that is not what the constitution of Kenya envisaged when they provided for the matter of picketing or demonstration we must have a conversation mimi kama rais haiwezekani ya kwamba ati tutumie maandamano ambayo iko kwa katiba kuharibu mali kuharibu biashara kulete mahafa kusababisha asara katika taifa letu la Kenya ati kwa sababu tunataka mtu mmoja wawili watano kikundi kimoja iweze kuendesha mambo yao ya siasa siasa inaendeshwa na sera siasa haiendeshi na maandamano so tukubaliane mapema na mimi nataka niwahakikishia wa Kenya we will mobilize every resource to protect the property the lives the interest of every Kenyan as we go forward Sio kama tumekubaliana jameni. Tuko pamoja? Ama kama sivyo, tukubaliane sisi wote tuketi chini. Tukubaliane maandamano. Tairi ngapi itachomwa? Magari ngapi itachomwa? Ni kitu gani itafanyika? Ni maafa ngapi ndio tujulikane maandamano yamefanyika? We must have a conversation. Ama na magani. Ndio tujue maandamano ni nini. We must have that conversation. We cannot continue to bury our heads in the sand that we are exercising rights of demonstration when we are actually causing anarchy, mayhem and destroying our country. That is not going to happen. Now